want to tell you this before I pray for you. Let us honor God before anything. Amen. Are you hearing me? Amen. Let us do what? Honor God. Let's honor God before anything. You know, because as people, we decided to put things before God. And that itself, it brings a delay to you. That's the reason why many of you, you, you are delayed. You are hearing me? How many of you want to put God first? You want to do that? Yes. Are you sure? Yes. Huh? Yes. That comes with a price. That, that comes with a price. A price of pain, suffering, rejection, hate from, from even people that we are trusting. Yes. You are hearing me? Yes. Offering yourself to God it comes with a lot of problems. The will of God is not always sweet. Can I say that again? The will of God is not all what? It's not always sweet. You don't expect the will of God in your life to be sweet. The problem is that when you're like this, you've got your dreams, you want to see your life this way. There are people that, that are in a program of Holy Spirit. And if you are in a program of Holy Spirit, you allow him to direct you. Huh? Are you hearing me? When you are in a program of the Holy Spirit, you don't control yourself. But your ambitions, your ambitions and your desires can bring sin and delay. You are hearing me? Amen. Tell your neighbor, say neighbor. Amen. Allow the will of God to happen in your life. Amen. If you do that, you will have peace. Amen. You are hearing me? Amen. And the will of God is not sweet all the time. Tell your neighbor, the will of God is not sweet all the time. <laughs> it will bring pain to you. I can give you an example. Look at Jesus. When he was about to be crucified, when he died that day, what did he say? That night, before they come to him, he said, let your will be done. Can you hear that? Amen. He was saying, God, the pain that I'm about to experience, there's nothing I can do about it because it's your will. Huh? Amen. You are hearing what I'm trying to tell you? Amen. Many of you here, you are going through the will of God. That's the reason why there's that pain. Amen. There's that problem that you're going through. Amen. But after the process of the will of God, I see you having peace. Amen. Are you hearing me? I'm saying after the process of what? Of the will of God, I'm seeing peace in your life. Amen. But at the present moment, this, the will of God has brought so much tears to you. It is good for you. I say it is good for you. Amen. Because you know what the will of God do? It takes channels that you are not expecting. It takes Bambi roads, roads that are doing like this. And sometimes you ask yourself, ah, can't you, why other people are living like this? Why me, there's trouble? Me, I only face trouble. I want to tell you, you're about to come out of that trouble. I say, you're about to come out of that trouble. I can't hear your amen. I can't hear your amen. Any test that God can bring it to you is not there to kill you. It's there to check you. How strong are you? How much do you trust God? Ask your neighbor, how much do you trust God? Huh? Because if you trust God, you won't complain the way you are doing. Where well, now if there's no share where at home you are complaining. 
There are people that are complaining every day. You know, I know I, 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 I see visitors every weekend. You know, every weekend I see. You, you will hear someone saying, this person does not have faith. Hey, what about me? Hey, man of God, why me? I'm going through. Hey, when, who's supposed to go through that? Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Tell your neighbor, say neighbor. Amen. You must drink on that cup. Before God can honor you. Tell your neighbor again. I'm not hearing you. Tell your neighbor again. You, you must drink on that cup until God honors you. Tell your neighbor for the last time. 